I'll play this new snippet that he got. I want you to tell me what you think about it, and I'll tell you what I think about it. Here we go. This is a new snippet. Then we're going to kind of get into what's going on with 6 9 recently. Hey! People, I'm gonna be honest with you. Let me give you my overall. By the way, I think this song is a smash. This to me is a mix of Afro beats and, and Latin music. Um, since he debuted the song Bebe, which obviously was a smash, billion views on YouTube. Um, I like the song Yaya as well. But I'm gonna be honest with you, this might be one of his best Spanish songs yet. Um, I don't know if the you know, and by the way, I don't think he cares about narratives because he capitalizes off everything. That's one thing with 6ix9ine. As long as he breathing, he gonna, he'll turn an L into a, a promotional tactic every day of the week. And I'm going to be honest with you, that beat down that he got might have actually been amazing timing. It's made him more sympathetic. It looked sympathetic to people. He already had Spanish music planted in the tuck. He's now showing that he identifies with the people who are coming from backgrounds who get persecuted on, who are poor, he's giving back, he's reaching back to his Hispanic side that don't really know about some of the bullshit he's done, like in the English shit, like taunting rappers at that, they don't know that, all they know is that every time he, he does Spanish music, is great, all they know is every time he speaks Spanish to them, he's talking about giving back and he's identifying with the poor, they're loving him, he did a bunch of interviews on like some Hispanic, you know, podcasts and he did Good Morning, um, he did Good Morning America, but like the Latin version, they love him. That was the, yo, by the way, brother, whoever you are, if you could send me, you, you did a great, you did a great motherfucking thing, bro. If you're watching this, fuck, just send, send it again. He broke down, I thought I downloaded it, so I'm so mad. Uh, chat just send it to me again if you can but it was basically um it was essentially a translation of like his good morning america interview uh he did a good morning america latin interview and, and i'll show you and, and what i what i think and i think finally i think six nine may be getting it for the very first time and and I don't think necessarily took the beat down for him to get it, but I think he's kind of get bro. Right now, and by the way, he's finally he's back invested in music. By the way, I'm, I'm gonna leak some shit. He he probably don't want to leak, but I leak it anyway. He got he got he got English music coming too, but he got a bunch of Spanish songs. He's tapping into his, that market that he's always dominated, but also he got he's finally recording and now planning to release music. He's planning to release the shit, which he hasn't done. So, uh, 6 9 good morning, America. He did a Latin interview. Let me see if I can find it on here. Uh, I probably can't find it. Okay, okay, it was no, this. Tú sabes, estoy aquí, estoy vivo. Honestamente, no sé. Estaba yo en el teléfono con una amiga hablando. All right, I know we don't speak Spanish here, but um, someone had a great translation. He was just talking about how the whole thing happened. And um, one of the relevant parts that I do remember that was translated in English, they asked me, he said, are you going to be pressing charges? And he said, no, I'm not pressing charges against any of the guys. He's like, you know, shit, it happened. Um, like, I didn't plan for that to happen. I didn't agitate nobody, whatever, whatever. But I'm not pressing charges. There's, there's a lot more stuff he said, but um, I can't find the, the full translation thing. And by the way, brother, whoever you are, just send it to me again that I could have it for next stream. Anyway. 
He's been doing a lot of interviews. And I'm going to be honest with you. The Hispanic market is loving him. And that's why I've always told people, you know, 6 ix is not white. And not saying I'm saying this is big privilege, but this is privilege. I think 6 9 is it's an uphill battle for him in hip-hop, but the Hispanic market right now is loving him. If you don't know, he's trending number one with that song. Look, look at Sir 6 9 on YouTube. The song is called Bori, featuring Lenier. I didn't even know who this guy was, but apparently this is the guy, this guy wrote for every big like latin artists like in the last whatever years look he's trending number one in music for a latin song on youtube like that's huge um and that's not even a song that was previewed i, I think the song was previewed is hotter than this um i talked to him i talked to him as early as this morning we, I, I, i'll be honest with you me and him still haven't fully talked about what happened in LA Fitness. Um, who knows? Maybe there's some content that comes out with me and him. And, um, well, I'll spoil it a little bit. But he said, when we do talk about it, he wants it to be fresh in the moment, not not us talking about it on the phone. But he, he's been good. He's, he's, he's doing his thing. He's excited about music. Um, I don't know. And this is going to sound fucked up. And I know I'm his friend. But I feel like this made him realize what matters. And all his fans picked him up. They supported him. And also, even the song, he's been getting so much support. He, you know, he hasn't done music so long that he realized, like, bro, yo, I'm fucking up not dropping music. Like, I got to feed my audience. I got to keep doing my thing. And I, I feel like we've heard the story before, but uh, I, I've heard about multiple songs being planned to be dropped. And... He gave me dates, which I'll just act like I don't know what dates are, but um, it's a good thing for him. Good thing for him. So, you know, salute to him. G gotta be able to take an L, just like you take all your W's. And um, he's explained this whole situation. Salute to all the Hispanic outlets who've definitely given a platform. Um, look like they're, they're understanding and giving him a chance. And um, yeah, whenever it comes back around to hip hop, you know, Big Act is here. We'll, we'll, we'll have a conversation and we'll see what songs and how he moves. He chooses to move that way. But um, in, in the most interesting ways, like some people would have said this beat down is the end of what he got going on. But it may have made him finally look like the victim in a sense or not victim, but like r remind people that he's human, remind people that he's. Like, you know, he's not the privileged guy who's, like, surrounded with security a million times, as some people might think. Yeah, he takes his L's, and we'll see. We'll see. Anyway, what y'all think about that? I see people in the chat say, Si, tu correcto, mi, fami mi, fami mi familia loves this song. I ain't gonna lie. People who are Hispanic-speaking and who likes... Hispanic music, they really love the music. So, hey, as much as we were going to count him out, this might be another opportunity for him to do some good things to make sure uh, his career could be whatever. All right. Somebody said poor people feel that song. I've been seeing that. Some people said poor people have been feeling that song a lot. I don't know if it's like it felt like a humble song. I, again, I don't speak. I speak Spanish a little bit, but not fluently enough to know everything. So I read the comments, but like I don't get everything and feel like they fucking with him, man. Here's a question. And I said this to him today. I said, from what I've seen of how the Hispanic community is reacted to you, they all feel like they should give you a chance or they're like, you know what? This guy isn't that bad, but that's not what people think in a rap community. Everybody in the rap community says, fuck you. But you like when they say, fuck you, what are you going to do with that? Right. We will see. 
Oh shit. Let's see what else is going on. Please. It doesn't even make any sense. This nigga Jiddy on is dumb popular. This nigga dropped a video and did 